11-year-old boy killed himself after believing his teenage girlfriend had died, allegedly falling victim to a cruel internet prank that nearly mimics the story of Romeo and Juliet. Tyson Benz from Michigan loved performing stunts in the water. But his family says it was a stunt on social media that caused his death. So you think this girl actually wanted Tyson to kill himself? I, I feel that way, yeah. Which is why you categorize this as cyberbullying instead of just a prank gone wrong. Yes, absolutely. You think this was a purposeful, mm -hmm. hurt him in some way? Mm -hmm. Absolutely. I'm so sorry that this happened. So, of course, there were emergency vehicles there. You did get him to Children's yes. Hospital. They did everything they could, right? Mm -hmm. Did he leave any kind of note, message, text, anything to you, his brothers, anyone? No, he didn't leave anything, no. So this was likely very much impulse. Mm -hmm. Yes. How long was he at Children's? They did move him at one point, is that right? He was at the PICU at U of M, yeah, for three and weeks. And did he ever regain consciousness as far as you know? Um. No, he never, he never did regain consciousness. Never no. said anything? No. I know that his older brother said they found a pulse. Yes. And they had him on life support. Yes. And they did a CAT scan and all the appropriate tests to see. And then on what date was it that he passed officially? Um, it was April 4th and he was on life support right up until mm -hmm. that time. And was that a decision that you had to make alone? I was there with my mother and my dad and my best friend. And um, yeah, so I had to, I had to choose, make the choice. And um, how do you feel about that after the fact? Um, it, was, it was the hardest choice that I, that I would ever have to make. But you were able to be with him during his final moments? Yeah. Can you talk about those last hours or moments? Oh, uh, I mean, it's pretty much extremely hard to talk about, but um, I don't even know how to describe it. I, I don't wish it on, on anyone or my worst enemy. It was, it was horrible. And he, I mean, he was so young, he was only 11. So, to see a little child who was so innocent and had the most, the brightest future, have to let him go was, was horrific.